So we're specifically looking at how microfibers that are of a plastic nature get into the ocean. And uh, one of the biggest sources of that is through laundry. There's about 40 million tonnes of synthetic fibres each year, each year for the textile industry. It's a great um, material to, to make clothing, however there's just a consequence when those plastics and that durability which makes clothing great makes it very difficult to degrade once they get into the environment. So this is uh, just you know, your average sports top made out of 100% polyester. We can use these fabrics to test a range of different washing cycles to work out which of these cycles releases the most fibres. And this is what it looks like. People don't, uh, don't really appreciate the, the, the problem that's happening. We have to be able to develop imagery and pictures of what's going on so that we can show the public what's happening. Polyester fabric. Magnified. So this is what you essentially see, all these thousands of fibres that get washed can come off our clothing and, and uh, enter wastewater treatment plants and ultimately end in the ocean. If you start to look at the effects of these tiny pieces of plastic on very small organisms, bacteria, protozoans, plankton in our oceans, then uh, perhaps they have a more damaging effect on these tiny organisms. Perhaps there is bioaccumulation and the ingestion of plastic which goes up through the food chain. So nobody really knows and we need to find out. So what we're interested in is to find the prevalence and abundance of plastics inside zooplankton. These are crab larvae, they are about like one millimeter. What we can see is the plastics that were ingested by the zooplankton. Once you found it, we can dig it. Yeah, so there's our fiber. Oh, there's another one. So it's an early science. We're just starting to experiment on the possible effects that this might have in all levels of life, including us. I think it's a problem that we all have to look at. It's the detergent manufacturers, it's the washing machine manufacturers, it's us personally, and how we go about buying clothes and washing clothes. The cycle choice is so important, right? So we'll try and use cold quick cycles, avoid, avoid those delicate wash cycles, um, avoid washing small loads of clothing, use high efficiency washing machines. We found new clothing was shedding much more fiber than, uh, than older fabrics. That's telling consumers another way that they can significantly reduce their amount of fibers is to buy less new clothing. You know, microplastics that are in the environment are really hard to remove. So it's understanding how we can do small steps to prevent more microplastics from entering the ocean.